Oh, what is up? And welcome back to the Energy Hot Pockets Castle and the Energy Crown Challenger Series. We got Ace U versus Ski Mask, the Slump God. This is going to be an insane matchup today, but before we get started, you know, we got to get the energy right. We got to open this up with a little challenge. We're going to play a little guess the apex gun or get pied in the face. It's a, it's a American favorite uh, so many children across America grew up playing this game. We're going to play it for you right now. Yeah, I've actually been researching these sounds for a long time, so you probably got no chance, but the first sound is going to be for you, correct? Yeah, so we got the sounds delivered straight to my phone. Here we go, first one. That's too easy. That's the R301. That's the R301. Okay, lucky guess, lucky guess. I believe number two is for me. Do you play Apex? Very little, but I researched it for this segment. Okay, all right. Let's see if you get this one. That's that's the hemlock. I, it's an easy one. I think it's the only this the only, only three round I, burst. Yeah, I only know three weapons. It's the only three round burst. All right, we're going gun number three here. Two for two. Rampage. No Spitfire. Spitfire. No. 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 It's actually, it was. Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh. I'll take it. All right. We're going to go ahead and get into the show. Just keep at, I don't know what to say. Let's just get, Avali, get out of here. Where are you? Go. Just get out. to the Crown Challenger Series. We are here live in downtown LA at the NRG Castle, home of the place where Grady was pied in the face. There's whipped cream everywhere, but that's okay because there's also so many cool things in this arena here today. Today has been, uh, it's gonna be actually pretty interesting. Not only do we have pies, but we also have amazing gameplay because today we are going to see two competitors take stage in this arena to play some Apex. And if you're wondering who are our two competitors, well, rather than telling you who they are, let me just tell you a little bit about their skill level because we're gonna have one Apex Pro player versus one content creator. Now you may be saying, whoa, 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 Avli, that doesn't sound very balanced. I feel like this person can probably just stomp all over the content creator because that's usually how these types of games go. But rest assured that we are not playing just your traditional Apex here today. We have got some really fun challenges and rounds as well as a couple spicy nerfs thrown into the mix to make sure that we level out that playing ground. In fact, Jake, I've got you over on the couch with me right now. Uh, what do we have in store for these players? Yeah, we got a lot in store. Welcome back to the show, guys. This a few weeks ago, and we're going to be doing it quite a bit more often. Uh, two guys known for their style, hopefully going to be known for their style in-game as well. We got a wide array of nerfs ready for all of them, and of course, chat will be heavily involved too. I'm going to keep most of these secret, though. Uh, I'm going to bounce it back to you because uh, we got some other things to announce too, right? Some other people to show off? so many other people to show off, including our two competitors that we will have joining us out here on the stage in just a moment. But like Jake said, there's gonna be some nerfs, there's gonna be some surprises because we aren't judging and we aren't really, uh, how should we say, scoring our players just on their gameplay alone. We're also gonna be scoring them in terms of style points as well as skill points. And while I may be biased, I may give some person a million points and the other negative 620 or something like that. That's why I can't be trusted, and we have brought in a panel of professionals to help us with the scoring process. Let's go ahead and meet our judges for today. First off, it's none other than NRG's Grady, and you cleaned up pretty quickly. I'm quick. I'm just gonna leave it at that, man. 
No, I'm just kidding. You excited for today? I'm I am so pumped. I'm so pumped. I'm cleaned up. I'm ready to rock. Shout out to shout out to the Ace fans. Shout out to the Ski Mask fans in chat. If you guys haven't seen, you guys are gonna be popping up all over the set, all on screen. I'm just excited to be here with all you guys today. I do want to say that, chat, Grady has you open right in front of him. So if you feel like you'd like to influence his scores or judging at all today, you totally can. And this is the man that you should be, uh, you know, harassing in the chat. But next up, we have EE -E joining us what again. Up, baby? Oh, you look good in purple. I like this Always. whole setup for you. I'm chilling. How you living? I'm doing good. I didn't get pied in the face, so I feel pretty good. But what do you think about uh, some Apex action here today? I'm excited. You know, this is the second time they're letting me do this. I've realized that every panel needs somebody who doesn't know what they're talking about. If you ever seen, like, American Idol. So I figure I'm filling that role pretty well, and I'm excited to be back. So who are you on American Idol, then? I know who you think I'm going to be, but I would say Paula. You think Paula? You yeah. think Paula doesn't know what she's doing? Well, I mean, That's she's not on the show thing. anymore for a reason. But oh then I don't think God. any of the original ones are actually. Damn. So it's probably didn't oh make any sense. Oh my God, all right. Well, poor Paula. We've got Ethos with us yet again. Now, Ethos, I've been told, has anyone told you about the new rule change where there's no simping allowed? I didn't, I didn't read that. You didn't get that because I feel like last time you were going pretty hard for Vinny, pretty biased. I, I disagree. Disagree, okay. So will there be some maybe unfair bias or potentially one-sidedness coming from you today in your oh, judging? Absolutely not. I don't think I've ever been biased. I've always been an honest person. I've always been just very calculated. I've always sticking to the stats, the facts. You know me, I'm a numbers guy, right? I'm a numbers guy. I even wrote it out, tallied up. I showed, I showed the work, right, for partial credit last time. And I plan to do the same here. I'm gonna be very straightforward with how I deliberate. Well, Ethos, I just want to sincerely and humbly apologize for making that assumption about you. I, I will never make it again. But one thing that I do want to say before we say goodbye to you judges is we have an upgrade to our setup compared to last time. Not only do you have fancy number cards, would you mind displaying one of your fancy number cards so we could see it right now? Look at that. We got fancy number cards, but we also have Sharpies. Because I remember some of you were trying to be artists last time with very skinny pencils and it just, it wasn't really working out. But these are three judges for today. I want to introduce you to someone who's probably the most important person here in the building today. And that, of course, is you, chat. Look at you guys. You're all blown up right here. We have so many people. We've got Asu emotes in the chat. We've got Ski Mask Slump God emotes in the chat. We've got, what is, is that a cat? Looks like a kitty that's just kind of like freaking out over here. Uh, we have so many new Crown Channel emotes in the chat. There's some of Jake, there's some of me, there's some of our big L. Uh, and all you have to do is follow the channel in order to gain access to them. Look at the little Jake one. It just, it just flew by. Beautiful, wonderful. All right, well, uh, E, did I just see you pop in the chat right there? You trying to like already lead bias? You trying to get your own emote? You gotta earn it, E. All right, ee has got to earn it, but listen, that's enough from me, that's enough from Jake, that's enough from our judges, because we have to find out who is playing here today. So without further ado, allow me to introduce to you your first competitor here. It's our Apex Pro player, but let's face it, he is cracked at any FBS game that he touches. It's Asu! Up. Okay, Asu, I was prepared to talk about, you know, just like your FPS prowess. Okay. But also the fashion sense the going on right now. or something. You do know, the spin, do I, the spin. I, I, I had a show out today, you know. You know how we're coming. I feel like I will never, I, I could sit down and try to study fashion for years and years, and I will never get to this. You've got like It's, it's just all things. black. It's nothing. It's just all black. This, this was not hard. I'm going to ask you a question. Okay. What is up with Valorant players, or maybe just FPS players in general, rocking just like the single chain? I mean, it's clean, it's not too much, and you know, it gets the job done, you feel me? It does. Have you seen Ender with like the string of pearls? I have not, but I can imagine it. It sounds pretty dope. Ender rocks the pearls, the but pearls, I do have to pearls ask go crazy. you. What do you know about your opponent here today? Ski Mask, Slump God. Hey, okay, so I've ran into Ski a few times, and I feel like I'm the challenger here, that's the thing. You're the challenger. Uh, yeah, You're the pro. No, 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 he's cracked, yo. I mean, like, he's like master. It's like, you guys are setting me up for failure here. Like, 
doing me dirty. That's all I'm saying. Doing me dirty. Doing you dirty? Well, yeah. I guess we're just going to have to let the gameplay speak That's for true. itself. So let's go ahead and bring out our challenger for today. Or maybe he's our favorite, according to Asu. It's Ski Mask Slump God. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. All right, come on out here, Ski. <laughs> yeah. Listen, man, this isn't cool. I'm standing between each of you, and you've got like a crazy millennium puzzle. Look at that yeah, thing. People don't know too Damn. much about this. People don't know too much about can this. Can we can we zoom in through the fog because we? we gotta we we have to talk <laughs> about this for a second for all of the Yu-Gi-Oh nerds and all of like. Look at that. Uh, you oh, opened it up. Hey. <laughs> That's me. That's Dang. cool. Hell yeah. That's sick. And I, plus, I feel like. What you have just on your wrist alone <laughs> weighs more than me. Like, that's so it sick. It is pretty heavy. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> <laughs> is it going to weigh you down in your gameplay today? Uh-uh, uh-uh. Definitely not. Definitely not. You got on the sure keyboard not. hand. Smart <laughs> man. Smart man. Yeah. All right. Well, anything that you want to say to Asu before you guys sit down, take your stations? Because he you're says you're from Middle. I'm going to need it, bro. <laughs> you're going to need the luck, <laughs> no, Take brother. it easy on me, all right? Come on. <laughs> you, you take it easy, all right? <laughs> all right. I'm going to allow you two to take your seats. Go on, sit down, put your headsets on, and I will let you know when we are getting ready to start our first round. Ladies and gentlemen, for the first time, it sounds like our challenger is a little bit uh, scared, or rather, our pro player is a little bit scared compared to our challenger. This is interesting. Jake, I'm coming over to you right now. Is our challenger the challenger for today? Or do you think, like Asu said, Slump has the upper, upper hand? You know, I really can't read these guys. We've been around them for the past few hours, and the vibes are immaculate, though. Like, everyone's <laughs> yeah. talkative. Everyone's actually chirping. Last time, Rogue versus Vinny, it was a bit quiet at times. So I'm super excited. We got a, a new little thing. We can pan to the player comms whenever we want to. It's going to be freaking fun. They both assured us they're also going to be trash talking as well. Oh, that's good. Because we had uh, threats of violence last time. Do you remember that? Yeah, and I don't think it's going to tone down this time either, but hopefully <laughs> the competition can remain competitive as well. As we head into round number one, you guys will recognize this one too. It's going to be five rounds on the firing range. So oh. it's technically a best of five. We'll probably play all five rounds out though. And as per usual with our pro player, Asu will be nerfed by Ski. Ski will be selecting the weapons he gets to use on the range. That's a pretty big nerf because, okay, if we were playing together, I think you're much more experienced at uh, Apex. You're giving me way too much I credit. Am. I think we both would probably be just about the same, you know? <laughs> Man, I went hard when the game first came out where I was just like playing everything and then they started coming out with all of the new legends and I'm like, I'm lost at this point. But, but in my, you know, like years, years back knowledge, I would probably just give you just two Mozambiques. That, that's, and that would be a good call, right? right? There's a lot of good weapon choices. And again, when it comes time for the judges, that does matter, right? So uh, let's say Ski wants to give him all the best weapons. He can choose any weapon. That might go to the judges. If he does say Mozambique, P20, some weaker weapons, that might go to the judges. So it all really comes up to Ski to decide what he wants Ace to use. But hopefully we see some tricky stuff. And, and it should be freaking fun this time around. And hopefully the boys are about to load in as well. Because I remember last time. Uh, these guys had fun on the firing range because after firing range it gets way more serious. Oh yeah, firing range. This is just kind of like our warm up round where everyone's kind of getting used to each other. We're testing out, seeing you know how good their opponent really is, and also just getting like a vibe check on your own skill level. Exactly. So firing exactly. round is always an interesting first round to start off. With. Oh, 100 percent. And again, like you said, kind of feeling each other out. These guys have also played with each other. We'll probably mention that a lot throughout the broadcast. They have actually streamed together as well, alongside many other artists. You know, Asu is, has branched out in the scene. Uh, Ski was actually praising him in warm-ups. Oh, real? But Asu on the walkouts was praising Ski. So, like, there's a lot of trash talk, but also a lot of respect between these two guys. I, I really do dig it. Yeah, I mean, like, uh, just from, you know, kind of, like, hearing of Asu, seeing Asu's, uh, like, hype clips and on Twitch and everywhere, I always thought that he was going to come out and just have, like, that confidence and be like, listen, I am the best of the best because, honestly, when you take a look at these stats, he kind of is. But to kind of give respect to Ski, great. Yes, and we will definitely be talking about that all throughout broadcast. And as we hop into gameplay here as well, a reminder to all the viewers, we will be continuously reminding you of the rules throughout this. We have several rounds. It's going to be four different rounds where these players can actually accrue points with our judges. So it should remain a close competition, but we'll see if one or, one or the other can actually pull away. Mm -hmm. Now we can see uh, both of our players on the screen, but why don't we take a listen in? Okay. Uh, 
Okay, fine. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes indeed. Oh, uh, you don't you don't want to know the weapons I'm choosing for you, brother. Oh, what the? oh man, my man put us in the, <laughs> in the boat. Oh. Come on. Wait, how do we get out of here? How do you get out of this? I, I don't know, bro. I don't know. I've never been in this. <laughs> <laughs> what, what what's going on? Um. How do you get out of this? Ah, uh, I don't even know, bro. Maybe we gotta like do oh, this wait, wait, or something. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> no, 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 no. There's no way. All right. Looks interesting over here. Change the lighting. Come on. Okay. I changed real quick. Nah, then, oh, it's shocked. All right. Um. If, I mean, you might just have to let it rip real quick. You know, hit the Let's little. This oh no. I'm sorry. <laughs> Yo, pop I'm off, so pop sorry. off. Oh, look at you. I'm oh, so warming sorry. up out here. <laughs> oh wait, he's going crazy though. They didn't even give me a gun. <laughs> I think we're going kind of fast. Wait a minute. I'm, I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. Ooh. I hit the world record real quick. <laughs> How did you switch up like that? <laughs> How long is this? I have no clue. It's 20 seconds left. All right, you're popping off. You're popping off. I apologize. I'm so sorry. Oh, now you're chilling, bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ten seconds. Man's just flexing his aim on us. I see you. <laughs> I might as well warm up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, it's finished. Oh. Okay, okay, um, okay, okay. okay. Does, it does, it like, it does it like end or something? <laughs> yeah, it <laughs> I mean, does, it does, it does. It does. Okay. Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, hey. let's do it. Oh, you, need, uh, you have no armor. Alrighty. I'm ready. Uh, I'll need a sight real quick. Right, I'm good to go. Players at all. No, not at all. Those I'm going to blame our players. Yeah, we'll blame no. the players. All right, so <laughs> that was a bit of a warm-up for all you chatters at home. We are now entering the firing range 1v1 officially. We do apologize, chat. They entered the wrong mode and apparently didn't want to actually shoot each other. So we got a little bit of a... A friendly interaction between these two. We are now officially entering round one. Ooh. 1v1's in the firing range. Let's see who can pull it out. Friendliness is gone. Asu with the P20 and the Mozambique. Those are the weapons that Ski has given to him. But <laughs> already, is the one who's been shooting. And oh, Ski finds a shot. Oh, shoot. Oh, Ski's cracking the armor. Ace definitely playing on high ground. And again, chat recognized as well. Not the best weapons given to Ace in this scenario. Yeah, but he's making it work. Look at that. Both shields cracked on each side. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Ski is being taken down very low. Here we go. Firefight down. Oh. Oh, no. Enemy down. And just like that, that will be the first point. Unless he goes for the revive. And oh, he's going for the revive. <laughs> they, they did do this in warm-ups, guys. You can revive your opponent throughout these five rounds. We'll see how the judges actually shields. keep that criteria in check as well. Yeah, I wonder what marks the end of the first round then, or if maybe this is just how they're resetting. Because it looks like they're fully resetting. Yeah. Uh, rather than the stop point. So I, I would say that this is going to be our match too. Yeah, so anytime Ace does go for the revive, we're going to get through that first point done. But again, remember, this is a best of five. We're probably going to play all five 1v1s out here. Jake, have I been saying Asu instead of Ace this whole time and no one's corrected me? Oh, you can say, I mean, yeah. the guy goes Open with either or. Nice play. shot there from Ski, but yeah, it, you know, it, he's one of those guys, he's got so many nicknames. Yeah. Asu, Ace. I'm coming, I'm coming from like the OG League of Legends scene where you get the Korean caster start screaming, Asu, Asu. So that's why I'm like, I, I feel the Asu vibe. But as we see, oh, oh. Ski taking oh, a Oh my. Oh, and yet oh. again. And, and I gotta say, we've actually seen these guys warm up quite a bit on the firing range. And this is what we kind of saw with Rogue and Vinny. The mm -hmm. pro players tend to know what they're doing on this game mode, this early game mode. Things will change as the nerfs do progress. But Ace, an early lead, 2-0 in the five rounds of 1v1 on firing range. You know what, uh, something that I'm noticing too is... Is it... Yeah, Ski isn't picking up a helmet. Ski doesn't want a helmet. Maybe he's trying to appease to the judges on, on the whole armor I, situation. I wonder. I'm healing. 
Or maybe Let's he's trying out. to... Eh? There. Let's see. No, he still no? hasn't picked up a helmet. <laughs> maybe that's just how Ski plays the game. Let's go ahead and listen in on the players. Punching a tunnel. All right, now I'm not taking it easy on you anymore. So. Setting a portal. Oh. <laughs> Chill for me, bro. Punching a tunnel. Oh. Get me out of here. <laughs> I gotta close that gap, bro. You got a sniper on him. I know you're not going up that hill right now. <laughs> I know I didn't see you going up that hill right now. Oh my god. Okay, wait, hold up, hold up. Oh, it didn't work. Yo, chill, <laughs> relax. I can't hit you with that <laughs> in the way. No! All right, I'm gonna get this down eventually. There we go. <laughs> oh, I have to reload, no, I have to reload my gun. All right, all right. How'd you just do that? I tried to, I tried a little something right there. You gotta teach me how to do I that. I got a little bit ambitious. <laughs> oh, with the finisher. Yo, chill, chill. Uh, my bad, my bad, my bad. Let's move here. <laughs> oh, man. The finisher coming in now. from Ski, but it's okay. They turn friendly fire off, and they go ahead, and they uh, pick them back up again. There's a lot going on here. You know, these guys definitely having fun with this, and you're supposed to. Right? This is definitely a still warm-up as we get into the more serious game modes and the more serious nerfs. And once these guys first see the scoreboard, the you know, score in front second. of them. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna... to... Ski, don't you want a helmet? Using a Phoenix kit. He didn't get a helmet, so I he, feel like... He's been picking up helmets. He has a helmet? Yeah, you should pick up he's a helmet, He's been lying to you, man. You should pick up a helmet. Oh, this guy... Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how we got to the point where Ski was just thinking, yeah, I don't need a mask. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, no, nah, man. No, nah, no. Nah. Okay, so the score currently two to one in favor of Asu, but still, Ski not picking Wait, up Ski's helmet. Ski's got nothing. This way, let's go. Ski's got absolutely nothing. What, what's going on here? Ski needs to stop entering this game mode. Oh, Ski. He went into the bow mode again? Be something good so now he's got to do the bow thing, for right? Anyone, for anyone, right here. anyone just tuning in, we haven't had this issue before where a competitor just wants to um, enter the mode we're not supposed to be on. Let's just enjoy it for a little bit. Ski just wants some more practice shots. Okay, all right. Yeah, and one thing I want to point out is usually, you know, this is the point in time where Twitch chat goes like Omega Lol production or like NA production or something like that. No, this is on our players. No. <laughs> and we also, guys, we appreciate the comms in chat. We actually can't communicate with them with them live. We can only communicate with you. So that's the, the real issue here as well. But hey, Ski needs the warm up. Again, the points still do stand in favor of Asu. And we'll see how those judges do uh, fit the criteria of the weapons they've chosen so far. Oh, now we're looking at us. We haven't had this are before. We, are we fighting? Is it knife fighting? Are we, are we getting pen. into this? We can... Just deck me, me right? Pinata. Just Hand deck me that pinata. I'm gonna I'd break rather, it over your head. I'd rather not, to be honest with you. Hey, hey chat, how's it going, by the way? <laughs> All right, it seems like we are going to do one last match of this round. And currently, I believe the score is Asu up two to one over Ski. So let's go ahead and see how this final match goes. Friendly fire now turned on. Ski picking up that sniper. Oh my. Opening fire finding it. Ski finding a shot and also found a helmet for this round. Taking it serious, we hear laughs coming out from Ski. He's looking for Asu. Asu, these guys are dodging and weaving. No. He is playing Wraith. He's charging forward. He's going to be able to clear a lot of ground right now. I set the portal. Chasing Ski up the mountain. Ski trying to desperately find that high ground, but Asu getting a couple hits to his armor. Asu looking up, finds a shot onto Ski. It's getting even more intense. Keep finding some shots, damage going down, or was that just on a target? This is a lot more of what I expected. A lot more tentativeness. Ace still pushing though. Oh! Oh! Both of them finding oh. shots, both about half HP. Oh, oh no! Hold on this. Ace finding that final kill. Gentlemen, stand up and join me because the round is over. Three to one. Asu taking advantage for the first round.
I'm disappointed. First thing I gotta say, <laughs> you're disappointed. I feel like production is a little disappointed. Why'd you keep going into the bow thing, man? Hey, look, it wasn't my fault. All right, um, I've never, I've never really been in firing range like that. I just be playing the game. <laughs> Felt that. I feel like you playing the game. Let's go ahead and take a look at the highlights, though, to see how well you played. Mastiff. Because. <laughs> Take a look at what we've seen in round one so far. <laughs> Asu, these were some of your shots. Hello. Boom, taking down Ski. I think here we go again, taking down Ski. That's two. Ooh, I just got lucky right there. Oh, he almost had right me, bro. That like 20 was pretty feet. close. Yeah. Nah, see. No, you had me here, though. <laughs> Definitely close, but Ski, I want to talk about uh, some of the guns that you decided to give to Asu. Why'd you choose what you chose? Come on, a P2020 and the Mozam is like the best guns it in the game. It did me dirty, bro. Come on. <laughs> the P20 the best, and the Mozi. The best guns in the, I let them have a hammer point. Like, yeah, come yeah, on. Yeah, okay, true, true. Come on, chat. Me up. Come on. Well, do you regret those decisions now? Very much so. Whooped you. <laughs> Very much so. Yeah, yeah. Now, going into this first round, you were saying that you were a little nervous about Ski because you uh -huh. ran into him a couple times before. You've seen his aim. You've seen how he plays. How do you feel after round one? Not too I'm, a, I'm a little bit more confident. But, <laughs> yeah, but, uh, <laughs> how dare you? <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, how are you feeling about Was this a warm-up for you? No, you this just was just a warm-up. I'm just getting right, my okay, hands warmed okay. up. You know what I mean? It wasn't nothing really any that serious, you know? Like uh, these other rounds, these other rounds I'm coming for him, so. Oh, all right, all right. All right, well, we're all just right. gonna have to get into those rounds. So I'm gonna allow you to take your seats thank once you, more you. and go ahead, throw your headsets on because I'm gonna go speak with our judges and I don't want you guys hearing what we have to say about you. Judges, let's go ahead. We're gonna go pretty quick uh, with this judging right now. So just, you don't have to show me the score right now, but how do you think ASU did? I think he did great considering uh, TSM Imperial Hal is continuing to raid this stream with his single viewer, and that's obviously putting a lot of pressure on mm. onto ACU and mm -hmm. Ski Mask. Um, but no, I think he did great, and, and honestly, we're just talking about Ace right now, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, Ace. Ace is beautiful. I love his gameplay. I love watching it. That's all I gotta say. All right, EE. -E. Dude, I started off not understanding what was happening, and then it blossom like a beautiful onion ring at Outback and I just suddenly understood everything Aww. and it's just like this guy is just a god to the game, it's it's the god to the game. amazing yeah I mean Ace or actually I, I call him Brandon because uh, I'm like that okay. oh you're cool so like cool that. you're so like cool that. All right. but uh you know we know he's the god of movement right and he, he is really good and I think he showed us everything that he's capable of doing uh in that match I will say though uh, he did die, so that could take off some points. But he did show us a really cool glitch while doing it, so I was very impressed by that, honestly. All right. So, you know, it might mitigate some of the damages there. But, and also, yeah. All right. Weird. Well, then, judges, I'm going to ask you to reveal your scores to me on the count of three, four, ace. One, two, three. Scores! We have an eight, a nine, and a six. The hell went on? What? All right. Those are pretty decent scores. Uh, we've noticed a little bit less from you compared to the other two judges but as you said he did manage to you know kick the bucket in one of those rounds that we had but let's flip it let's talk about ski right now and ethos we're going to start with you how'd you think ski did uh i think ski did a great job holding uh holding up against uh ace but you do have to remember that he is ace was playing on a uh p20 and a mozambique so it is really difficult for Brandon to actually go and, and try to close that space and kill him. So when you say Brandon, you mean Ace, right? Yeah, Brandon. Bra oh, sorry, I, I, totally, sometimes it totally slips understand. my mind. But uh, yeah, I think uh, overall he didn't do too bad. But you know, obviously the score speaks for itself, and we'll have to see how that turns out. Nah, Ski was dope, bro. I mean, he came in with the swag. Boy got the whole Millennium puzzle on his chest, and he was hitting some shots too. I don't care what Ace is shooting. It ain't hard. It ain't easy to keep up with that man. So I think he did good, respectable round one. All right, I love it. Um, Star Wars Confederate rifle, shoot like ray beam. Watch me turn around 360, no scope or something. All my bills blue, uh huh. All my bills blue, uh huh. These are, these are, these are the words of Ski Master Slump God. And when you rap about it, you gotta be about it. And after that display right there, taking a game off of Ace, this man's about it. He's about what he raps about. He's about it. <laughs> All right, well, you're already making a friend with one of our competitors. So that being said, this I want you to This is the coolest reveal... I've ever felt in my entire life, right here. <laughs> I would like for you to reveal your scores for me, for Ski, rather, on the count of three. One, two, three, let's see him. 
nine, eight, and a five. Oh, okay. I mean, I feel like that was exactly what we had just seen. I'm not gonna try to do math on camera again. I did that last time and it worked out terribly. So instead, we're just gonna wait till we have the final scorecard to tally that up and uh, you know do the math for me. But that being said, I'm glad that you've been able to find a new friend. Let's go ahead and see the scoreboard after our first round of the day. Right now it is 23 to 22, ace in the lead. Look at that, but remember, this is just round one. We still have so much more gameplay to see. So we are going to be taking a quick break, but when we come back, we are getting straight into round two, so don't go anywhere. gave his life hunting the enemy. His task is now mine. Speak your truth. Stand with me. Ours was no chance meeting. Not fate, nor destiny. Ours was the work of something greater. I am not the hero you seek. Whatever it was you did, be free of it. It is here the moment we feared. Why do you keep fighting? There is a tempest in me! Evil does not sleep, it waits. My name is Holo, and in today's video, I'm going to be highlighting some of my favorite Omen Gaming Hub features. Optimizer has this awesome feature called Booster that ensures you're getting maximum performance out of your PC while you game. Light Studio makes sure that your entire gaming ecosystem looks better than it ever has before. Use Oasis Live to stream gameplay to up to 15 of your friends. Earn free games, items, and even real-life merchandise with Omen Gaming Hub rewards. Head on over to omen.com right now and download Omen Gaming Hub today. Welcome back to Challengers, everyone. Now, chat, I've got you right next to me, and you all just got a look at the optimizer in the Omen Gaming Hub, which gives you a crucial FPS boost through CPU and GPU optimization. Click the link in the chat for more, because right now, Ski is going to need an FPS boost as they're trailing behind by one point after that first round. But remember, there is still so much more gameplay that we have, so I'm gonna ask our players to join me. Asu, Ski, come on up. Yes. We are about to get into our second round of gameplay. You're currently up by yep. a single point. Whole point. Did you think it was going to be this close after the first round, especially after your performance? I had a feeling. Um, I'm not. I paid off one of the judges, and they gave me a <laughs> six. So I'm kind of disappointed. I feel like you uh, paid I them think, off for real. I, uh, we're gonna have to have a talk That's after this, all right, bud? But other than that, I think uh, we got a good game on our hands. <laughs> do you think that he should still be allowed to call no. you Brandon? No, he lost all privileges. He, he, he oh! can't do that anymore. Okay, sorry about a six, that ethos. A six, Alan. Hey, you got a new friend today. We, we got a new friend today. Oh, he's calling him Alan now. It's not even ethos anymore. But hey, you are only one point behind. And I'm he's the pro. It. You're the challenger. It's so close. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. You know what? I know he's probably taking it easy on me, but I'm liking it right now. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, I'm gonna let you two go sit down because we gotta get ready for the second round of gameplay. So go ahead, throw your headsets on. We'll tell you when we're going. But Jake, I'm coming back over to you because we're about to get into our second round of the day. What do our players have in store for them? Yeah, I wasn't kidding with all of you guys. Well, when I said this, it's gonna get more and more serious as the competition does go, all right? Round two is actually my personal favorite. We call this hide and don't die. Both these guys are gonna load into a lobby together 
And there's a pretty big nerf when it comes time for Asu, is he actually cannot heal during this game. But both Ooh. these guys, they also cannot use their weapons. It's pretty straightforward. Hide and do not die. Survive as long as you can in a game of Apex Legends. Last time we saw this was nuts. Oh, it was so good. We had uh, people hiding in trees. Yes. Uh, we had, I think it was like Vinny, who was just pleading for his life with yeah. one of the other final squad mates. But something to remember is that they were the final squad, not once, but, but twice. twice. Yes, uh, so it's definitely going to be a fun time. Uh, that will be the nerf for now. And as we go on throughout these game modes, it should be more and more fun. We'll see if these guys actually choose to work together. You know, we saw Asu reviving him on the firing range. We'll see if he revives him in-game, how the judges actually analyze that as well. But it should be a fun time. You know, who doesn't like to just hide and see if anyone can actually find them in-game? So also keep in mind, proximity to enemies, right? Can you be real close to them without them knowing a lot of these things the judges will actually take into mind as well. Exactly, because if you're just kind of like, you know, hiding right outside the zone yeah. and then just kind of like moving in with each time, I don't know if that's very stylish. Yes, and I'm really curious to see when we drop into player comms, if they're going to be giving e uh, each other, you know, IGL comms. We had Rogue, who was actually talking a lot with Vinny yeah. and giving him direction. So we'll see if these two are, are friendly on the server or maybe deceiving as well, giving false comms. Uh, so it should be a fun time, but we are actually loading in as well. So let's hop into the player's gameplay. Again, for all you viewers out there, this is hide and do not die. Whoever survives the longest should come out on top this round. Absolutely, but remember, our judges, they can award <laughs> points to anyone just willy-nilly, but apparently not Alan anymore. Yeah, you never know with these guys. You know, half of them are paid off apparently by half of our talent, uh, but I do love how talkative both these guys have been so far as well, so I can't wait to hop into player comms later on. Mm -hmm. And I absolutely love seeing all of the uh, users in chat using the new Crown Channel emotes. Remember, in order to go ahead and spam your love for either Ace or Ski, all you have to do is follow the channel, and hey, TSM reps raiding with a party of over a thousand people. Huge shouts to reps in the chat to all you guys, but also we've noticed something novelty, something different from last time. These guys are landing separately. <gasps> Rogue and Vinny dropped together when they played this, so they yeah. are. This is going to be exciting. This is actually great. They're, they've broken off from each other. Ace and Ski, again, if anyone just tuning in, this is survive and don't die. These guys cannot use weapons. Asu cannot use heals. Whoever survives the longest will win this round. Presumably, we'll go to the judges' table. Oh my gosh. All right, let's go ahead. And actually, we can jump into player audio to see if they're talking with each other. I got that bird. Let's explore this way. 30 seconds until the ring closes. You like putting it close, huh? I think that. I'm actually frightened. Must <laughs> 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 be. Uh... I'm about to be hunted out here, bro. This is <laughs> this is not okay. I need to find a hiding spot quick. Ten seconds. The ring is fairly close. I need to find armor ASAP. Ooh, high key. You could probably like hit that beacon and like see where to go. I got some bats. Oh, you're right. Oh, but I'll also see the beacon though. I forgot we're on the same team. <laughs> <laughs> you're helping us both out here. Oh, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> nah, I'm not using this yet. I'm hearing shots already. Oh. I went to the middle of Narnia, I can't lie. I gotta get to the zone. Oh, you're deep. I'm deep as hell. Where are you? Oh, what? <laughs> I'm down here. I'm chilling. How are you? Are you in the zone already? Yeah, it's kind of cozy down here. I can't lie. Care package being delivered. Low key, Bro, I'm in the danger zone. Package. They're not giving me a break with this armor thing. Oh, I'm still on the white tee. <laughs> that is not white. okay. <laughs> white tee. <laughs> My man in shambles. <laughs> I'm down kind of bad right now. No, I'm, uh, no, I'm gonna lie. I've seen a couple blue armors. Yeah, that's not even right. I'm not about to tell you where they at though. Okay, wait a minute. Hold up. Come on. Come on. Get me an armor. Uh oh. Let's go to this place. The Apex gods just don't like me right now. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Oh, okay, there you go. Yeah, I was just talking yeah, he didn't shit. He came up. <laughs> I was just talking shit. Okay. 
Oh, say less. Oh, really? Oh, I was out. I was staying near people. Oh, that's fire. What if I steal a care package? <laughs> Don't let nobody get it. Yeah. <laughs> Pop the master again. I am. Aki, there's still 16 oh. teams left. What the? Death box over there. Why is it open? Half what? the squads remain. Let's oh, I winning. see dudes. Just spotted someone out there. I'm taking it. I'm not using it. <laughs> <laughs> no, wait, what'd you get? What'd you get? Let me find out. A, a little rampy. That's a little rampy. I'm about to go get a kit package too. Yeah, just to let not let no one have it. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed, indeed. I'm liking it so far. I'm oh, I got a gold cool helmet. I'm trying to hear some shots. That some game didn't find anybody. Yeah, me neither. Not right now. In case you guys forgot and can't see on screen as well, Survive and Don't Die is the tactic here, and two very different tactics from both these guys. Ski dropping outside of zone initially, Asu going right to zone. Of course, they are um, now in similar locations, but. Anyone just joining? Yes, a very different tactic from both these guys, and they're not hiding themselves in the map. No, uh, in fact, it looks like Ace has kind of jumped through the skate park right now, uh, kind of having the time of his life. Yeah, does he make it? Oh, he goes straight <laughs> through the ring of fire. Straight through the ring of fire and straight into all of our hearts. Um, but yes, remember, this is hide and don't die. There is the nerf of absolutely no healing for Ace. Uh, but as we can see, Ski is just kind of like running around with Pathfinder. Yeah. Just trying to avoid anyone and anything because you cannot attack people. And Asu picking up the Octane, so definitely <laughs> chat pointing that out. A big brain play from him. Uh, we actually did see earlier with Ski. He uh, finally did find a decent armor set as well. He can actually use heals. That is a big advantage for him. So we'll see, especially with them playing it out together and right next to each other, enjoying themselves. If it comes down to a heal off, right, a team comes up and kills both these guys, if Ski can somehow get away and heal up, he technically wins this round. We'll see what the judges have to say about that. Absolutely. It looks like 11 squads left, 21 people. Can we get to the final two squads again, off? I feel like it's possible. I mean, know? imagine these guys win a game where we got to beat some people down. Win we haven't game, seen it yet. They can't fight. Or <laughs> Because I don't even think they can punch, right? I mean, we never really clarified those. I feel like if it came down to final two squads, we break the rules for fist pumps. So, uh... That would be interesting, to say the least. I see that there's still like a lot of love for Ski in the chat right now. People want to see him win. Yeah, who do you guys think is going to win here? Ski or Asu? Coming off round one, it was a close battle in the fire range. More of a friendly fire range, really. Mm -hmm. A warm-up for all these game modes we have yet to come. For anyone just joining, we have four rounds in total. This is the second round and second game mode we're going through as these guys accrue points against each other. Oh, They're dropping a another squad actually eliminated currently only 14 other people left shoot it's coming down in close the lobby. and again you guys can see on your on your screen the details of this round as well as the scoreboard ace to a slight lead on ski this is going to be a very important round whoever wins this round will take the lead in the matchup or maintain it remember ski is only one point behind Asu right now so a little bit of style a little bit of skill anything can add up there's not much else ace can do but watch as ski tries to maybe Ooh. find some better stuff here yeah you see it Ooh, ski sees someone right ahead of him i wonder if he tries to avoid him i'm just Get glad in. ski has a helmet for anyone just tuning in we have the firing range oh, oh. ski's getting shot at just about half of round one, Ski did not go for any helms uh, on the firing range, so I'm glad he has at least something for a base. All right, Ski's putting the fists up. It's like, come get me. I can't fight back, but come get me. Definitely oh. attempt. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. It looks like Asa is actually trying to draw people towards him using that weapon towards the ground. Very interesting for Ski to bait anyone into a fight right now. Very cocky of him. We'll see mm -hmm. the judges <laughs> take that into note. To face challenge anyone with your fist out, uh, definitely ballsy. Remember, uh, um, excuse me, Ski is allowed to heal. So I think he's just looking for a place to pop that shield. He took his time there. He definitely took his time. Ooh, looks like Ski is still drawing fire. 
but it looks like Ace has rejoined him. It looks like Ski doesn't really want to heal. I don't know if this is a strategy of his. I think he loves the the thrill of being low health. I don't know. Yeah. Now, for people who are just joining us and are a little bit confused as to why we aren't playing, uh, you know, like your standard game of Apex, this is a special game that we here at the Challenger Series have invented for ourselves. It's called Hide and Don't Die, where basically we throw two of our players into the field on a team, and the last one remaining out of the two of them is the winner of our challenge. Chat's asking for a Ski Mask album right Yeah, they now? also asked for a little rap battle for round three. We don't have that planned right now for all of you guys in chat, but it could be something soon here. Again, keep in mind, seven squads left. Last time we played this with a pro and a competitor, they made it to final two, and they, they got beat for sure. Again, you guys cannot shoot uh, against their enemies. Ski can heal, Ace cannot. Ace can pull out an armor swap, though, if he's able to find one. Oh, and look, both oh, of them oh. are actually sneaking up on another squad. I wonder how they're going to take this. Uh, let's go oh. ahead and jump into player audio. Why me? 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 He's on your head. Why me? Why me? Why me? I'm in the cut over here. Oh my god. Hold on. <laughs> um, I was thinking sometime this month. Oh! oh. Or maybe next. This month you heard it next. here I, first. I, I, I love October. What is that? Oh my god, did they see me? You think they saw me? You know what? Oh, they did not. Oh, they're getting crazy. They're very much involved. Oh my, that guy just... <laughs> oh, they just died in front of me, bro. There's no they, way they, that they don't they're see They're all just you. dead, bro. They all just died. How did they? Oh, Bro. they're shooting. Oh, I'm pissed. You might want to get out of here, I can't. <laughs> these guys are hungry. I'm pissed. They've been looting these bodies for about 10 minutes now. I see another care package. Uh oh. Oh. Here I, go. I think they heard me. Oh, they're portal. Wait, what? If they run away from you, I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> they shot buddy. the hell out of me. These guys got no clue. I'm about to come up on a red armor, Loki. Chill out. <laughs> Not a fresh one. Did they all leave? Oh my god, I'm dead. Yo, I got a red. <laughs> Hold up. I'm looting up. I can't lie, I'm kinda kidded. Were they not gonna chase me? Alright, where you at? Oh, you're in there, in there. I hear them. Get away from me. In there. Okay, okay. <laughs> Man's got a whole little house in so. Can you stand up here? Oh! Oh! Yo, Ski, help me out. I see. Help me out, bro. He shoot me with the bow, bro. Where'd you get a red shield from, huh? You tell me that first. <laughs> <laughs> I came up. <laughs> Got a nice little bag. There's no way. Already inside the ring. What do we Um. Oh. Package. I love loot. There's another attacking. Hold on, don't let me die, please, <laughs> please support us. <laughs> Using grapple. You're gonna have to chase me, boy. <laughs> um, I love them. Uh, I went, uh, asked them if they just came, went to the tour I just came off of. Um, I got a whole bunch of stuff to say to my fans, honestly. Here I go. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm going for that care package, bro. I'll tell you that. Oh, word? Yeah, 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 nobody getting that. 
It's kind of risky, bro. They're about to oh, be over they there. Opened it. They just yeah, they're about it. to be on that thing. I'm on a rock, OP. I'm kind of chilling. I'm in the sewage. Hmm. Wait, top four? No way we survived. Yo, we're out here, actually. Oh, I felt. Uh oh. I think I can make this jump. Uh oh. Oh shit. I might be in trouble. Me too. I'm in trouble. Oh! Come on. Oh, we're chilling. We're chilling. Yo, they broke my armor. Oh no, we're not chill. We're not chilling. Give me the fuck out of here. <laughs> Give me the fuck out of here. Recharging shields. Uh oh. My armor. <laughs> <laughs> you got broke a white armor, up. bro. <laughs> you got the fat downgrade. You oh. got a white armor. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be something around here. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah, who's grappling? What are you doing, brother? Get out of here! Hey, chill. Bro, they're about to chase you. Oh, my God! We're out the zone right now. Oh, they're here. Yo, let's get up here. Wait, I don't think I can't do that. You can't, you can't, but I can. Oh, I can do that, though. Yo, there's no good. way. There's no way. Yo, that you my guy. Thank you. <laughs> there's no way he figured that out. It'd be a shame if someone. Oh. It'd be a shame if. <laughs> Bro, chill with that. What are you doing? You're gonna get us both killed. Wait, well, hold on. Watch this. All right, all right. Dude, they're gonna fuck you in the zone! <laughs> well, take, take, that pad, take, take that pad, bro. Take that pad, bro. See what happens. <laughs> Wait, we're Loki's about to win this. Oh! Why is he not shooting you? Okay, you paid, you <laughs> paid that guy, huh? He can't hit me, I don't think. Oh, he's trying. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Whoa! Oh my god, I got white armor. He's about to kill me, bro. Yeah, he is. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, get back in there. Get back in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Crazy fast. Oh my, they're going crazy with the senses. I'm out of here. Oops. Oh, is that the play? It might not be, honestly. Yo, let's get up here. Oh, we can't. Oh, you can't stand up there. I'm dead. Nah, you're chilling. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, no. You're dead. I'm dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. <laughs> no. <laughs> No! Shut up, wall bounce over it. I'm gonna die. No. Oh, I could have probably shot the fence, huh? Is that cheating? Let's go. No. Let's go. <laughs> They're looting my body, bro. They're looting my body. <laughs> oh, they had, you had no loot. <laughs> hey, so can I kill you guys? Bro, go for it. Win it. Oh, beam them. Yup, yup. Yeah. Oh, wait, that's the last guy. Body him. Oh, he brought it home. Winner decided. Yeah, that boy different. <laughs> oh my God, you 
that just happened? Ski Asu joined me up right here. Champions. What a little crazy. <laughs> What an ending to that! <laughs> what a little that crazy. Nice. What an ending! We had Hot Don't Die, and it was interesting because both of you started out going your separate ways. Yeah. You met up in between. So wait, whose decision was it to go uh, separate, different ways. separate ways? Honestly, it was kind of both of ours. It was kind of both like, should we? Get... Nah, let's just separate. Let's just split. Let's just split. Dang. All right. Well, I can't believe that you pulled out the win at the end there. So Come congratulations on. Like to you. Like, I'm gonna go straight over to the judges because we have to figure out. Everybody in that out. lobby better be pissed. <laughs> oh, they better be. They better be. But guys. Well done on that round. Go Thank ahead, take so a much. seat. I'm going to go talk with the judges right now. Judges, we're going to speedboat this a little bit because whew, I can't believe that that's how the game ended up. So let's talk about Ski first since we saw him just take that win. What did you think? Never seen anything like that in the Challenger Series. Not only did he win, but he ended in style. I mean, I don't, you, you can't ask for more. That's my take. That's all I got to say. I think Ski is different, bro. I think he's built different. I think he knows he's different. I think he plays different. I think that was the difference maker. I was impressed. Yeah, carrying off that, his money different, his life's different, his muscles different. I'm just kidding. No. no, but for real though, like that was the perfect game. Like he had the confidence, he was having fun, he, he wasn't playing back at all. He won the game, he won both games, he won the challenge and the game. This guy killed it on all fronts. Yeah, incredible performance that we saw from Ski. So with that being said, let's go ahead and see what scores that you're going to be given Ski. Three, two, one. Water, but it's a seven? Ten, ten, and ten. That's ten. Yeah, it's, e, put that, put that down. All She's right. Back. Ten, ten, and ten. Perfect score for Ski after round two. That's going to be difficult, rather impossible to beat. You can only match it. So let's start talking about Ace, our pro player for today. Grady, what do we think? Uh, you know, disappointed. It is uh, it's the word that comes to mind. Um, look, he gave it his he gave it his best shot. Uh, Ski mask is is a, is a challenger, man, and he's gonna challenge him. So I'm excited to see him get to get to kill racing next round. I don't think he expected. I think he just naturally expected he would outlive, and then didn't expect Ski to actually just have like the performance of a lifetime to close that one out. So I think maybe Asus was his own or Ace was his own worst enemy there. Alan? Uh, now look, I think that I owe Ace an apology because I did actually end up holding the wrong card and I actually doubled down yes. on it last time. So I have a little uh, visual graphic about what uh, my deliberations are this time around. So let's see uh, the scores. Follow, follow the uh, story here. So first off, we have uh, me. It's me, Brandon, and Ski. I call him Brandon, by the way. We're all good. We're having fun. We're friends, right? And then next up, we have uh, me accidentally holding up the five and the six card not even understanding why I did that. And then they were like, what the heck? And then this coincidentally, consequentially created or caused a rift, a divide in our friendship. Here I am begging on my knees, trying to get their friendship back, but they are very angry. They're not having none of it. By the way, you can see uh, Ski's uh, Millennium uh, puzzle right there as well. But as mad. you can see, to finally make up for it, I've decided to award them an eight and a 10 here in eight for an ace and a 10 for Ski. It was going to be 10 for both, but then Ski had that amazing performance. So Brandon's performance went down at the end. But either way, high scores for both of them. They did great. So but what are your final scores? Let's see the final scores up. Ooh, a six from Grady. EE -E with a set. And <laughs> Allen with an eight. Ooh, those aren't really the scores that you want to see for our Apex Pro here today, but that's what they have. Let's go ahead and see the scoreboard with all the scores tallied up. And right now we see, oh, would you look at that? Ski taking the lead 52 to Asus 40. Four. That is quite the lead that Ski now has after round two. And guys, so we are getting directly into game three. So without further ado, Ethos, stand up. Come on, you're joining us over on the couch. Ethos is going to be one of our new casters today. As Jake, you explain to me what's going on for round three. And go oh ahead, boy, scooch over I'm, there, buddy. I'm yeah, yeah. This. Wow. There's, scooch over. There's so much going on here, uh, not just on this couch, but also in the game. This is the first time during the Challenger series we've seen a challenger actually take the lead. Why is it so warm? Uh, I'm really, I, it's it's hot in here. I'm a little sweaty, too. I, I should have warned you. I shouldn't have scooted over. <laughs> you scooch back hey, I'll over scooch back second. into the hot spot. <laughs> we have Ethos uh, joining us, but excuse me, tell me about round three. Yes. So as we enter into round three, for anyone at home, of course, it's a close competition. Ski is now officially 
quickly taking the lead after a great performance. We are now entering into a brand new game mode. That's going to be a scavenger hunt. So these guys are going to load in yet again together. They can go for kills. They can go for style points, skill points, whatever you have not. But they also want to search for the best loot in game. We're talking guns, attachments, sights, backpacks, whatnot. They want to get the best loot in game. That is it. They also can go for kills, of course, like I said before, and we'll see how the judges do correct that. It's a brand new game mode for us. We usually would go for kill races, yeah. but with this competition is still close, they want to go for the best stuff possible on this drop. All right, so how are we scoring things, I guess, in terms of picking up the best loot? Is that up to our judges? That's or? why we brought a judge in. How would you score this? Um, basically, I count the number of times that the contestants look over in my direction, and then I tally them up, and I make a deliberation based on that. Okay. And then how do you feel about Ace saying that you can't call him Brandon anymore? We don't, we don't talk about that. I selectively deleted that from my memory, so deleted I don't know what that. you're talking about. I feel like he's, he's rescinded the permission. I'm just back to another Twitch stuff. And with that, we're entering a <laughs> brand new game mode, round three of four chat. Hope you're all staying active. A lot of Ski fans out there, a lot of Ace fans out there, very active as well in the chat. We appreciate you. Now time for a scavenger hunt. These guys are selecting, are going for the best looting game. Here they are, dropping in. Jake, you smell so bad. What? Are you saying that we smell bad? Is that what? Just said, no, we oh, just all, we've all bad. gone. I, I'm the sweatiest guy on the couch, yeah. okay? I'm uh, I'm heated, okay? You may be the sweatiest guy on the couch, but who's the sweatiest guy on stage I right now? I can't tell. Oh, wait, can they hear us? Yes. They can oh. hear. <laughs> oh. I don't know why we gave Ethos, the <laughs> most corrupt judge, this kind of power. Ethos, you got Hey, but it looks like Ski actually picking up a gold helmet straight out of the hey, drop. Ooh. A helmet that's for amazing. Ski. Yeah. A helmet that's for Ski. Good. We didn't see that in the firing range at all. So that's wow. a yeah, and they just gave it to him right there, and he still didn't take it, so pretty good. Yeah, let's go ahead and listen in on our players as they are currently collecting loot. Yeah, 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 my boy. How you liking that Revenant? <laughs> oh, yeah, that's my favorite character, man. I can't wait to play Revenant. <laughs> How's your loot looking? Oh, you got a gold helmet. Wait a minute. Oh wait, no, I just dropped the I gold. No, like nah, no, you didn't. <laughs> Come back here. G give me that. No, 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 no. Okay. I got a gold scout. Oh, wait, the gold. Wait, that's a, wait a minute. That's not even Ooh. fair. <laughs> I got gold attachments and shit. Yes, sir. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see if you find that Kraber. Oh, is that like bonus points for the Kraber? A little care package weapon? Most likely, yeah. Alright, I'm ready. Let's go. Wait, let's do we get points for people. killing people? Yeah. I think oh, so. stay less. They wanted us to be aggro, so. Let's pick this care package clean. I see people shooting right there. Oh, yeah, they're popping off. Don't spook. I'm about to go see what's up. Yeah, they do the same thing. People are dying over there. I'm in flying in. Oh, 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 oh. How am I missing? How am I missing? Okay, okay. Full squad down. He's, got, he's got a gold box. What's in your pockets, center. buddy? No, no, no. Oh, I'll take that off you. Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. Oh. Oh. I got a vantage. Where's he at? Somewhere over here. I think. Yeah, she's running. Yeah, she's she better. There. Shooking an arc star. Oh, hey, yeah, they're oh, crazy the in there. On, our prey. on the roof. Somebody's inside. Yeah, he is. I could have swung out an arc star. Reloading. Got that. Where's the advantage at? I think she's a part of a different team. Oh, oh yeah, hold they're here, they're here. Oh, I'm out of ammo. 
What are you doing, buddy? Hey, that's my kill! <laughs> oh. <laughs> is that somebody else? Oh yeah, they're inside, inside. Oh Let my god, in, bro. I'm die. I don't have a melee key. Oh, you popped Just off. Yeah, I need some uh, energy ammo. You got that? Uh, I got the double light. Double light. I'm healing. Almost died. <laughs> you popped off better. though. <laughs> healing up. Oh, energy. Let me get that. Let me get that. Yeah. I should have took it. Just, just, no, <laughs> just be on the same team. <laughs> Are we? Yeah, I, I don't know. Know. It's looking pretty even, but uh, I'll tag the ethos here in a second. But when it comes to weapon detachments, you know, Ski had a very early head start and a, a great advantage, and they are still somewhat playing together. Uh, now, Jake, this is just where your inexperience really shows. Like, <laughs> looking at uh, the loadout here, Asu clearly in the lead here. Uh, I will continue to call him Asu until he. It gives me back the permission to call him Brandon, but yeah, look at that. He has the R99, the Volt, he's got the purple armor, and like, just look at him, and he's also got that hair, like, his loadout could not be just more fine. I didn't realize the hair came into the, the loadout, uh, you know, fracture. The, and that's a rookie mistake for me. Yeah, honestly. I, so, similar to attachments, is hair product yeah, also? Ha yeah. I would say so, yeah. Okay. And that's my apologies, Chad. I didn't realize that, and I hope Ski realizes that, too. Okay, we're, we're familiar that you don't really use hair products. Yeah, yeah. we get very. that. No. Haven't watched it yet this week, but it's very oh. apparent to everyone that looks at you. <laughs> <laughs> but either way, Ski, going back to Ace. They're both under fire here pretty heavy. Oh! Ski taking oh. very low oh. right oh. now. Oh, oh. oh. One, he's but so nasty. Himself. And he goes down. We'll see uh, what Ace does here. He's kind of waving his battery in his face. I thought that. Oh, oh my toy! Oh my god! Oh my! Before I kill you and he will go for the revival. We'll see how the judges, like the one to my left, actually takes this into the whole numbers game. Yeah. Do you, yeah. Do you like seeing revives, or do you wish that they would just let him go down? No, I absolutely love seeing revives. I think sportsmanship is uh, great. Uh, at the end of the day, Apex still is a team game, despite the challenges and everything. I think that at the core of the game, sportsmanship is still very important, as along with. Uh, you know, Brandon being a pro player uh, in Apex, he knows what it takes to be a good team player as well. And I love seeing that shine through. Oh. Look at that movement. He's so nasty. He's so gross. I just threw up in my mouth a little bit. <laughs> Do you want to see? No, I'm good. Actually, I will take a peek. At a new kill leader in the game, that's going to be Asu with six kills. I believe Ski with four. So they are still pretty close in the kill race and still pretty close when it comes to loot here. Slight advantage maybe towards Ace, but again, it's close when you take into, of course, account the, the attachments as well. Ooh, finding another target right on the horizon. Ace might clean that one up. Ace, oh, he's so he does. nasty. Great observing from our observers. Ooh, absolutely eliminated after the knock. Oh, and he's feeling oh so high. Oh, he's beaming, kids. And for anyone just tuning in, oh, there's just nothing they can do. His movement's too good. He's low, but he's not even oh, scared. The clean. Oh, and Ski will clean it up. And for anyone just tuning in, we are in round three of four. The scoreboard is still in favor of Ski after this round. Who knows? Ace put up a great game so far. We do have four rounds in total. We are in round number three. Surprise game mode's coming up. This one going to be the best loot these guys can find in game. Kills do matter, but when it comes to attachments, armor, everything in game, you are trying to find the best loot you can. Wonder if in the future we should have skins play into account, like a fashion show. Yeah, that would be great. Forty-five seconds until the ring closes. Why looking wait? for more loot Let's go. here? Mm. We'll say that gold helmet is helping out Ski a lot, but looking at Brandon's, sorry, Ace's armor fully upgraded to the absolute max potential. Um, you know, that's just that's just the bread and butter right there. That's yeah. very key to have. Uh, the armor is obviously a large part of your wardrobe, right? Along with, you know, your kicks and your accessories. Of course. Uh, the rings and everything. 
But as we grow closer and closer to the end of this game, seven squads left, let's go ahead and take a listen in on our player comms and hear how they're taking it. <laughs> All right here. Pop in a bat, pop in a bat. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Look at this. Wait, this guy okay. pulled up. Shattered the shield. Okay, buddy, what was that? Like, <laughs> what the heck was that? <laughs> that guy's <laughs> ambitious. Feel that himself. Was so brave. Oh, oh, that's another team behind him. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna nah, die. You're chilling. You're chilling. Wait, I'm gonna. Oh, he's got a master! Wait, 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 wait. Okay. I got you. I got you. Oh, I, got I, got you. I got one. You got. You got this. You got this. Little one v one. I'm dead. Nah, I'm actually up, dead. Peel up, peel up, peel up. You're chilling. Oh, he's in thirty. He's in thirty. Recharging shield. No. Oh, he's got a thirty. He's trying to kill you. Chill. Oh, that is not my art. Hold your shield. Hold your shield. Yeah, I got you. I got you. Recharging shield. Oh, oh, he's pushing, pushing. Flame, flame and knock. Flame and knock. No! <laughs> nice try, nice try. He's, he's just better. He's but better than me. a Mastiff on him. How's that even oh, fair? Oh. Oh. That was super, uh -huh. super close at the oh, end worry. right there. Players come up and join me. I'm going to ask you about what just happened there because... <laughs> straight second. tragedies. <laughs> straight tragedies? I mean, it was feeling pretty Nothing bad. Nothing but tragedies just happened. What happened? You got knocked. He had a master. Yeah, yeah, he, he was on two people. can't make this up. He just pulled out the, the, the thing, the thing. But imagine if you were able to take him down and take that loot because this was That'd the scavenger crazy. hunt round. Right, that would have been true, sick. True. Tell me about to yoink it. what was your final loadout? I had a gold G7, a gold helmet, and I'm not too sure what else I had. <laughs> gold, 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 really quick, what did you have? I had a gold knockdown, Volt with a gold mag, R9 with a gold mag, and I Ooh. think that's all, and gold, wait, did, ah, that's it, that's it, that's all the gold. All right, I heard gold, 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 <laughs> gold, 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 but I mean, listen, if we're talking about loadout, I feel like Ski and the arm, what he's got on his uh, wrist right now, I feel <laughs> yeah, like that's, that's the loadout true. right there, but you two take a seat as we let our judges deliberate. Force, Ethos, force. get off the couch, come on, come back all to right, the judge's right. desk, come on, come on. <laughs> All right, guys. So the name of the game for this round was Scavenger Hunt. Okay. Trying to figure out who had the best loadout, right? So, Grady, how would you rate Ski's loadout? Um, you know, I thought, I thought it was a pretty good roll. It was a roll that I could probably roll with in-game. Um, it, uh, it is crazy to see what he did at the end of that last game with the loadout he had with the Spitfire. So I would love to get that Spitfire back in his hands. But I thought it was pretty good. Pretty good loadout. Pretty good. EE? -E? Not bad. Um, obviously, you know, I'm sure like he was, you know, the desire to get more was there, but that doesn't always mean you can accomplish it. But I think he did well under the circumstances. Well, under the circumstances. All right. You were with us on the couch. We heard a little bit about what you would think in terms of revivals, but we're talking about loadout right now. So how do you think Ski did? I think Ski did great. I think he definitely, that, I think that gold helmet definitely helped him uh, keep, you know, somewhat competitive with Brandon, sorry, Ace at the end, right? But. Ace did have that maxed out armor, so that is a pretty big lead to have in terms of loot, right? But that G7 Scout did look pretty nice, it's pretty dripped out. It did. Full ice. It did look nice. So then I'm gonna ask you to reveal your scores for Ski for me. In three, two, one, what do we got? Ooh, is that an eight? An eight, a seven, and a 23. Three. So unfortunately, we are only allowed to have 10 points as the max. So I'm going to go ahead and take that as a 10. So an 8, a 7, and a 10 for Ski from our judges. Not too bad in terms of scoring, but now we do have to talk about aces. So Ethos, I'm going to come to you first. And remember, please respect his name. Call him Ace. There's no Brandon here. Yeah. How'd, how'd he do? Uh, I think Brandon did great. Uh, he did clutch up at one point and got that res off. I definitely put in... Uh, points for that. He was aggressive all game, which I love to see that confidence, that movement, always looking clean. It looks like he's just training his movement every time he plays. And yeah, I mean, he did, he did die first, so I will have to subtract some points, but he did have the better armor, so. That he did. E. I thought he did fantastic. I mean, it was a good bounce back game from the previous round we saw, and I think he knew that he needed to perform really well to kind of make up the point differential that he was facing. So I was impressed personally, as you know, my man Ethos said, it was a nice little loadout, and uh, the armor was looking clean, and so was the gameplay. 
Grady. Uh, I see Daff in chat right now. She's asking when Ace can get back home. So I'm just going to skip my what? commentary and get right to the score. All right, let's jump straight into the scores. What do we have for Ace? A nine, a nine, and a 25, so that's another 10. Oh, those are amazing scores for Ace on the board from our judges. And I like the message that you have there, EE. E. I feel like everyone has the same message in our hearts. Let's go ahead and take a look at the final scoreboard for this round. And right now we see, oh, five points away with Ski in the lead, 77 to Ace's 72. That's only five points uh, apart from each other. And still, there's one more round for today. And we are going to get into that final round. But before we do, we are going to take a quick break. So don't go anywhere, because when we come back, we're going to see if Ace can catch up to Ski. I am Eternum. And Eternum is me. Welcome back to the Crown Challenger Series. We've got Ski versus Asu here today. Five points with Ski currently in the lead as we are about to get into our fourth and final round of the day. Things are heating up. We're playing Apex here, and the games have been so close. We just got to see our scavenger hunt. We also got to see a little bit of firing, uh, or excuse me, firing range at the beginning of the day, as well as some good old fashioned hide and do not die. Now, as we are about to get into our fourth round, I'm going to grab another judge to join me and Jake over on the couch. EE, e, get up. Get up, man. Come on. You're joining us over on the couch. We got to hear some of your commentary, man. Show me that you can cast Good some Apex yeah. as I walk over and join Jake over here. Jake, as EE e finds us over here, we're about to get into our fourth and final round of the day. Yeah. What yeah. do we got for our players? Uh, I'm, I'm a little winded for some random reason. I'm sure these guys are too. It's not a short competition and we still have a few game modes left. So for all of you guys watching out there, we have a round four split into two different parts, but we're going back to good old classic Battle Royale. Now you've seen this one before with our former Challenger series. We're going old fashioned Battle Royale. These guys are gonna drop together as well. But when it comes to this time around, Asu, his nerf being the pro player, he has to use the first two weapons that he lands on. Ooh. And hopefully, yeah, we'll, we'll see if they go separate. We'll see if they go together. We saw earlier they were actually separate. We'll, we'll see how the strategies do uh, kind of fall out for these guys. E, e, I know that you said you haven't played much of Apex, right? But Jake, I'm going to ask you this question then, since he's you know are lacking in terms of being a judge. Uh, are you usually happy with the first two weapons that you find? Hold on, I can I can answer. Hold <laughs> oh, you want to answer? No, no, no. I don't want to set enough. you up to fail, man. Now look, Sorry. I can say this from the perspective of my man Ski's probably like, I like options, I like variety. I'm not just trying to be locked down and boggled down and held down with whatever I got on the first, you know, what I'm saying the first playthrough or whatever. But for Ace, 
That boy is a sniper. Okay, he don't care what ops is coming. He going blah. So it don't matter what you give him, he gonna be effective. I'm glad that we have our expert here on yes, the couch with us to accompany us through this gameplay as they are currently loading in. Remember, they are dropping in as duos and we do have the gameplay on the screen right now, seeing which uh, legend it looks like Ski is going to be selecting. Looks like we're gonna see the lifeline and potentially a Wraith, which I feel like this is a pretty standard combo. I feel in the past we saw, what was it? It was Valkyrie and was it Bloodhound last time? We've, Who do we see Rogue we, We've seen a definitely running? a good mix here from both of these guys, mm -hmm. and I feel like Ace has definitely given this some proper attention when it comes to trying to play to his advantage, which is also surprising because Ski still maintains his lead, which kind of just speaks to his skill in the game. And we're going to talk more about Ski throughout this, but chat, just in case you know, if you don't know, as they drop in here, Ski has over 4,000 hours in his game, as we talked True. to him earlier. So both these guys are heavily experienced, and they've played together which we'll see here if they actually drop together or if they play apart. Yeah, it was cool, actually. Yeah, I mean, I remember they played, uh, I think I think Post played with him as well. So definitely have some uh, some experience together. And Ski was telling us, too, like he didn't get to play quite as much as he wanted because he just got off tour. But now that he's back in action, he feels like it's starting to flow. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The muscle movement is coming back. And I think it's kind of proven this man can hang. Mm -hmm. Facts. And as they drop here, that was a key mention too, because this guy, you know, just like Ace, you know, Ace has a, maybe a bit more time to game on his hands. We, we got Ski coming off tour, obviously producing music too, but he's getting back into gaming with this kind of show. They are dropping as teammates here. Cascade Falls, it looks like Ace already able to pick up a weapon. About to pick Chasing up a kill too, man. Down, got them yeah. man shook. Oh, oh dang. able to find the first knock, and oh, would you look at that. Let's listen in oh, on the player oh, audio. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. No. I'm dead. Sorry. We got I this. think the lifeline pick actually just <laughs> confused me. Uh, might have fumbled the bag right there. <laughs> I got to heal real quick. No, no, you're good. She's on the roof. It's a Valk. She's going to wait for you to try to oh, come yeah, right and probably jump down on you. Hey, Valk. Back up, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> she, she ran yeah. so fast. She tried, bro. She tried. That's the champion. Get out of here, bud. Oh, no oh shit. Oh, shit. More go, 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 go. Oh, I beamed him. I got to go. Got him. I got to go. OK. I'll be able to help you in one second. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got, I got no shields. Keep calm, darlings. We're already inside He's outside. The next and... Okay. He's climbing to the roof right now. You need you queue up on him? Uh, put him. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm ready. I'm with you. All right. And as we interrupt the player comms for just a second, as it looks like Ski is trying to find a kill right here, and actually Ace is able to successfully pick it up, I do want to direct your attention to the bottom right because somebody's cheating. He's still switching weapons off. He's cheating. He started with an alternator and a Mozambique, and he thought, eh, you know what? The colors are the same. The judges won't notice. But he swapped it to an R99 and a Peacekeeper. The so Ace thing, has just cheated. The crazy thing is we're sitting here right next to a judge who's watching it with us, and the dude continues to swap weapons. I I didn't should see I, anything. Should I go tell him? Sh should he, I go tell he, him? He I mean, just now found out. He just found out, found out live. Oh, then let's go back into player comms. Let's see what he has to say. That's all. I'll, I can change back. I, wait, wait, do you know what I had? Alternator Mosey, I think. I'll go. I got, I got, I got it. Oh, that's so ugly. Oh, that's so ugly. I, I have to go find little guns. I totally forgot about that shit. <laughs> I'm over here, like, looting everybody, like, swapping through everything. Okay, there we go, there we go. Yeah, do you want this? A little skull piercing? I found a hop up here. Uh, I'll take it. I need some light ammo if you see that. Alright, we're chilling. You got bats? I got three of them. Uh, <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Right, let's go kill some dudes. On the biggest map of them all. <laughs> yeah, we're probably not about to find anybody out here. Hold on, let me 
Let's see. There's a yeah, a little care package, a little something. Kind of far. Yeah, it's a little out there. Yeah, it's just got a backpack. Gravity Canyon. Oh, I'm about it. Yeah, I'm down. You motherfucker. <laughs> Do a little bit of cheating real quick. My fault, my fault. <laughs> Legal movement. <laughs> Actually. <laughs> <laughs> You're the legal movement doer, huh? Nah, I'm just playing. <laughs> what you got? You got that bolt? Oh, bolt. Ooh. Oh, holy. Okay. Oh, shit. It's gonna pop us in. Oh, we got dudes. I'm pulling up. I don't know why I did that. I only had like. Let's then pop the drone real quick. I got five, five shots. Man, that's all you need. You're right, wingman. <laughs> way too, way too OP. <laughs> yep. I'm almost there. I'm on my way. Again. Track one. Again. Oh, it's playing. <laughs> Oh, I, I want this. I'm sorry, I'm coming. He's <laughs> <laughs> chilling. This man looting real quick. Oh, he ported me. Yeah. Grenade. Oh, wait. Oh, this might not be good for us. Oh, he's cracked. Hold up. Yeah. Oh, there's somebody behind us. Who smoked this? Was that him? Uh, no. Nah. Oh, right here, right here. Oh, he's cracked. They're both cracked, I think. I, really? How'd you down? Bro, you yeah, went How? <laughs> With the Mosey. How? He was that much How? 1 HP. Bro, the Mosey goes crazy. Oh, I'm a problem. What am I, what am I witnessing? <laughs> what am I witnessing? I don't think that's no hammies. I still need some hammies. That was no hammy? No hammies. Nah, it sounds like you got a hammy on that thing. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're lying. I wish. Oh, I got a bolt now. Oh, it's Raths. Where's that light? Oh, Lobo oh, real quick. With the hammies now? Okay. Really far. Okay, okay. There's a care package right here. Oh, now let's get that care package real quick. Replicator incoming. Oh, that's a massive hundred percent. I smell it. I <laughs> it's I smell it in the smell air. Smell it in there, yup. <laughs> Crater. A little behind the rock care package has to be a Crater. Yes, sir. That's all you. And as we currently have eight squads left, 16 people, including our two players. I am, oh, no, no way. Oh, no. I'm so curious to see how these judges take in the fact that Asu had a, a bit of a mishap to begin this game, but they are still working together to maybe win this game. So I, I do Phoenix, like the fact these guys clearly like each other, but are still competing. You know, as somebody sitting on the judges' table, you know, incidents happen. I think we can all address that. And he did, at the very least, say, you know what, my bad. <laughs> Didn't quite understand what was going on at the beginning. And I've watched this man's streams. He's incredibly articulate, incredibly intelligent. I don't think... That was on purpose. Yeah, I think he got caught up in the moment. I think you he know, did. A miscom right there as yes. well. And they're back in it. And certainly he is still frying, even with the Mosey. Yeah, but Ski finding that Kraber from that uh, random care package that it dropped, like that's going to be massive depending on how he uses it. And, and uh, again, another reminder for all you guys partaking and actually just joining now, we are in round four. This is actually two parts. This is part one of round four. Oh. We will have another game after this one to decide who takes this Challenger series. Oh. oh. Just the sheer power of that weapon. Let's go ahead and jump back into our player comms, hear what they have to say. Oh, he beat him. He almost beat me. Handle our ones real quick. <laughs> I knew she was gonna run. <laughs> I knew she was gonna run. <laughs> you see that lifeline Kraber? You turn around. <laughs> For sure. Okay. Let's do it. I'm with it. 
I mean, we're trying. Yeah, we're trying. Yeah, this is this map. It's, you can't find anybody's big ass map. I got red shields, Mr. Mozambique. Hey, you know the vibes. Oh, come on. A hard landing. Oh, I need one of these. Hmm. Top four, this one's looking like a dub. Oh yeah. We can't choke these. We eat these. Surely not. <laughs> Surely not. <laughs> Whoa, I'm like surfing. Whoa, what is that? Where's the people? Dudes? Where? Nah, that's me, that's me. Uh, should we get some warning shots real quick? I don't see anybody. Um, hmm. Not a soul. Usually people are in the zone. True. We'll pull up when the zone closes. Yeah. Then abash your sail. Here's a pick me up. There's a care package right behind us. Oh, I think I saw someone uh, over here. Shall we head this way? Yeah. Yeah, I think at the bottom of the zip. I might be tripping. Oh, no, no, they're zipping up, zipping up. Spotted a bomb pole over there. He's got a massive, he's got a massive room. Back it up, back it up. I cravered one, I cravered one though. Only oh, super low, super low. I got him, I got him. I'll stay behind the box. Why is everyone in their mom of a master? He might have dropped down. Oh yeah, he's running. Is he really? Oh, he's low, he's flat. Oh, that's the one I cravered. Got him. Nice. I didn't even heal. <laughs> he had so much. <laughs> bro, he's shaking, so much. bro. He's terrified. <laughs> that guy had a mastiff if you want it. Right here. Oh. Uh, I'll take it. What's up? Where is it? Uh, down here. Yeah, right here, right here. No. <laughs> yup. <laughs> All you, my G. He just fell to the bottom. Bro, I pulled up. That guy almost one shot me. <laughs> that thing is so scary. Oh, I'm ready. You already Man, got the you Craver ready? Mastiff. Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> you already seen this Man, in my hands. Kidded. I may have heard That's somebody. Good. Really? Oh, I think they're over here. Fancy we stroll this way. Let's chase him down. Get him. <clears throat> Get him. Get him. <laughs> Get him. The ring's close. Oh, and we've got a whole minute, minute to do it. I thought they shot. I got was brave with the master if you climbed the whole box. <laughs> <laughs> climbed a oh, slow yeah, climbed the yeah. box. Actually we went all the way. Oh, oh, I see you. That's me. Oh, okay. Oh, they up up. Oh, no, 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 not a fuse, not a fuse, not a fuse, not a fuse. I'm pulling up. Oh, this guy's low. The horizon's like 1 HP. Okay, I'm on top now. I'm with you. Wow. Good. Wow. Come on, man. Wait, 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 no, no. All right, you got this. You got this, bro. Pop off. No. 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 You got this. You got this. Oh, they're chasing. Uh, yup. Mastiff to the face. It's two of them. It's both of them. Oh. It's oh, both of them. So close. So close. Okay. Cool. God, that Close third at right. the end right there. We almost saw them take the entire lobby. But what an amazing first part for, to that round. Yeah, I uh, couldn't have asked for much more. The competition does remain very strong and very, very close. Uh, a reminder for all you viewers at home, we are in round four. We're going to enter right into part two of that final round four. What you saw just there, Ace, 
you know, little mishap, miscommunication there early on, was not allowed to actually change from the initial two weapons he landed on. We are now entering into our final round and our final game for all of you viewers at home to separate these two. One will come away with the winner, one will come away with the loser. It's going to be an all-out battle royale. Simply how well you can do, how well you can place. Of course, kills come into play as well. No nerfs across the board. These boys are just playing. This is where you can earn a lot of favor with the judges. As somebody who sat on that panel, this is what we want to see. Knock down, beat them up, just slanging and banging, okay? That's all we want to see. It's time to get dirty. That being said, we can't just completely discount what we saw in that first no. round, especially with Ace, who had the rules pretty clearly communicated to him, right. switching both of his weapons in the early game. I mean... They made it compelling down there at the end. I mean, you're really rooting for them. You know, they didn't get the dub, but if he didn't switch those weapons, maybe we don't get to that point. Maybe we don't get that build, that excitement leading into this final round. But still, he cheated. He did. He but, cheated. But it after happens. correcting his, his mistake, he did hop back in and had it one heck of a game alongside Ski. And you look at the scoreboard, they're both so close. I think no matter what, it's going to come down to this game. Uh, yeah, I'm not a judge. I can't really make that call exactly, but with how they've... In, in the great words of Rihanna, don't tell me you're sorry because you're not, because you know you're only sorry that you got caught, Ace, with the freaking switching <laughs> of the weapons. You've got to be losing points there. But again, we're not the judges. So again, uh, the game I... afterwards, who knows what comes into play here? Um, listen, anything can happen. This is where heroes are made this is where legends are crafted and born and you can already argue both of these these players are of that caliber but who's the one who's going to get a little bit more shine on that mount rushmore of gaming in apex right now exactly that's the question as we hop into our last game all you chatters out there who's going to take it now these guys have been vibing the whole match long they've been competing but also vibing it's been great we'll see if we can see some trash talk out of these guys we'll see if they land together it looks like they're going to stick this one out. It's an all-out battle royale here for Crown Challenger Series. What can separate ASU from Ski or vice versa? Let's uh, let's see exactly what can be done in game here. All right, as we're dropping in here, Cascade Falls again. It seems like they really like to land here. Potentially comfort. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But immediately Ski already finding another opponent, chasing him down. He's got the Ava. Let's go ahead and jump into player audio. Yes, I have more than one chasing me, actually. Be careful, be careful, be careful. No, 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 no. One. No, he's beating me up. No, no, no. He's... I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. <laughs> Look at this girl lady. <laughs> <laughs> what is she doing? Both hands. <laughs> oh, no. Yo, she's relentless. She in there with a gun? I got her, I got her, I got her. Yeah, she got a gun. <laughs> she was not giving up. Nah, she was punching us with both hands. <laughs> <laughs> I have to pull high away. Oh, another team? I got a heal. Yeah. Uh. Syringe here. I don't know where they went. They run. Got some boxes out here. I think. I hit. Oh, in here, I hear him. So I have like no ammo. I headshot one. There's one uh, out here. No. Oh, he's super low. I'm out of energy. I'm, I'm dead too. No, nah, you're I'm chilling. dead too. Oh. Nah, I froze. We, we kind of both froze, actually. Coming <laughs> in. So I have no ammo. Right, no. too. Oh my god, I got beamed. How did you kill both of them? I think this is a different team. Is it a different team? Who'd you just kill? The rape. The rape? Yeah, it's the rape. Oh, oh ball, dude. Oh, baldy <laughs> ass. How the hell did you kill her? I hit her with a beam, I can't lie. I would have like 140. With the white shield, no health. <laughs> and a little armor swap right there. The 30 30. There's an R9 up here. Help me. I got no ammo. I'm gonna have to crash. Oh, here. 
Energy ammo here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Of course, of course. Of course. We don't have to ask me twice. <laughs> <laughs> Peacekeeper here. Yeah, I'll take it. No I don't know what I'm doing with this Eva. We got the That's Eva. Right? I have no idea what I'm doing with it. <laughs> then they buff it. They buff it. Hey, low, low key slaps now. Yeah. But you have to have like a bolt for it to be good. Yeah, no bolt. I'm running no bolt. They got Eva. no bolt Eva. I'll take a mosey yeah. over that. <laughs> Getting punched out. <laughs> that Loba had the hands. <laughs> she was patchy. <laughs> Crafting, but keeping focus. Let me see. Ooh, if I can find some more energy. Did you put that energy? Uh, I don't know if Andy dropped it in a box or something. I only have like 20. That was nice. Actually, that was I think nice. I used it. So so we don't, we don't need to get into weapons here. We don't, we don't need to get into too much dialogue. Uh, chat, we, we do want to know, though, who's going to take this one, Ski versus Ace. Feel free to go spam away. Is Ace going to take it? Is Ski going to take it? It's still so freaking close. They are still playing together, and we might be in the long haul for a great last game and a great last finish here. This is no rules. It's all out battle royale. E, what have you seen so far? Anything stand out? Well, I mean, just the fact, I mean, well, both of them still being up is fantastic, obviously. I mean, obviously at first glance, you're like, oh, Ace has this under the bag, there's no nerfs, you know what I'm saying? It's a map he's familiar with and comfortable with. But then you keep in mind, like, you know, Ski's won a couple of these rounds. He's performed incredibly well. He's got plenty of hours invested into this game. You know, it, it to me right now, it's too hard to call. But as far as, like, from a judging perspective, this is a must win and win big for Ace. I like that. I like that a lot. We're seeing a lot of chatter saying Ski. We're seeing a lot of chatter say Ace. I like how we've had some friendly banter between these two guys so far. They are clearly friends. They've made content together before, but hopefully they realize the jacket is on the line and the L is on the line for the other person who did not take home the win today. But again, it's going to be close. I just love how this is actually a real close matchup. And like you said, E, it's going to come down to Things like that at Ace. Holy. I mean, that wasn't even a, a full second. He just deleted that man. Shadow Realm. Damn. Need to recharge my All right, we can actually jump back into the player audio right now as we have only 10 squads remaining. You know, right? <laughs> it took the cannon. I'm chasing him down. Why do you leave his teammate like that? <laughs> He's down. Oh my god, he pulled out the shield. That was the last one. <laughs> he was ready for you. My so that wasn't before my eyes, bro. That wasn't his teammate. Yeah, yeah it, was, it was. I got the kill for both. Wow. Bro, that guy took the cannon and just you died. You killed him so fast, <laughs> I didn't even see you kill him. <laughs> I mean, he couldn't move because he took it, and so he just like hit the hard fell to the ground, you know? <laughs> Three beams. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Oh, we're going to the zone. That's round one. Yeah, we just want to loot this guy real quick. Yes. Energy. All right. Oh, inside, inside, inside. Oh, really? Yeah, crack the valve. Recharging my shields. He's above me. One on scan. Oh, outside, outside. Whoa. This guy's a crazy. Okay. He's a demon. He jumped on me with a white shield. <laughs> <laughs> yo, was... yo, this guy pushed me no shield. He was flush. <laughs> no way. Like, these guys are actually maniacs. <laughs> way too Mad confident. Madmen. <laughs> actually. I, I'm feeling good about this one. Hmm. Oh. Maybe not. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'm down to rip it. I got all. I feel like I heard someone. 
Maybe not. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'm down to rip it. Burn, how copy? Main engine burn. Want stream my choke percentage is very high. Like uh, I'm about to <laughs> pop off right here. <laughs> yup. They're taking our scraps. <laughs> they really are. What the heck is he this guy is he going? He's this guy's ambitious. Whoa, oh, wait a minute. Wait, I drop, 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 I drop, I drop. I'm popping the bat in here. He's cracked. I'm popping the bat. I don't know where his teammate's at. I'm gonna get back I on the roof. He... Yup. He went around. I had a feeling. You, you can fly the roof if you get pushed. Yeah, but they're both okay. inside. Eyes are open though. Yeah, fly up here, fly up here. You mother. I almost cracked him. 90 on the new castle. Oh, 130 on this guy. I'm probably, we should push this guy over here. Yeah, dude. Watch. Watch out. He's flash, flash, flash. No, oh, I gotta oh. reload. Yeah, hold my shield, hold my shield, hold my shield. Double uh, flash, double back, flash. Back. Yeah, pop the back. No way, that guy's hitting a finisher. Yeah. Because they're both flash. Finish, finish up first guard. No way. I, he pulled sorry. out that PK. That was my fault. Nah, you're chilling, you're chilling. Oh, you guys are beaming. Oh, look fault. at his health, bro. Literally one HP. It was my fault. That was. I'd reload both my guns. So close, right there. <laughs> yeah, not me too. <laughs> yeah. That was incredibly close, guys. Come on up and join me really quick, as that was our fourth and final round. A little bit of an unfortunate way to go out. Yeah, what happened there? What happened? Uh, I mean, we're on stream. My choke percentage is very high, so I don't usually play on stream. So it's a different yeah. setup too, you know. Yeah, it's true. We it's just, not what I'm used to. Yeah, we just I'm ask everyone element. to <laughs> close their eyes, so technically they aren't exactly watching you on stream. Maybe that'll help out. Yeah, but for real, right? Again, it felt like that uh, second part of our final round. You guys really found your groove. You guys were moving. Oh, I know that going. Ethos call, uh, calls you like the movement king, but I <laughs> felt like you were having some really great movement plays as well. <laughs> that's, funny, that's funny. I, I hope so. I hope so. I think I failed a wall jump or two, so I'm not sure. Definitely. Well, what did you think about that second round now that there were absolutely no nerfs on you? You were completely free. You were released. Hey, we were feeling ourselves, kind of unfortunate we couldn't bring home the win, but like, so like it, it is what point. it is. It's the storm point. It's the storm point. It was the yeah, storm we, we point. We win that on World's Edge for sure. For sure. Catching the dub on World's Edge for sure. Absolutely. Now, I do have to ask one question from our first round, or rather the first half of this round. Okay. There was a nerf set in place. Okay. Oh, yeah. There yeah. was a nerf set in place, and it feels like you didn't follow the rules. I and cheated. what we have to ask was, was this intentional? No, it was not. Or? Okay, so I did this thing <laughs> where I, uh, I have you. a short-term memory loss, where I just, honestly, <laughs> I forgot about the challenge, and I, you know, I picked up a new gun. That was my bad. Okay, well, you don't uh, have I'll to. Say, I'll take the L on that one. You'll take the L on I'll that, take one? The L on that yeah, one? Yeah, you don't have to tell me or ski my I'll bad. I'll be holding that oh, as well. <laughs> it's, it's to the judges that you gotta say my bad to, because they're the ones who are holding your fates in their hands. And we are going to get uh -huh. into judge deliberation. We love you, judges. Right after <laughs> this commercial break. So don't go anywhere, because when we come back, we are going to have the judges speak in the final score of our two players. Like what we call a peripheral. You think this is a game, but it's real. It just hasn't happened yet.
Welcome back to the Crown Challenger Series. We have just concluded all of our gameplay between Ski and Asu. So now all that's left to do is speak with our judges for the final round of deliberations. And judges, just to kind of refresh your memory of what we just saw, we do have some highlights available that we could go ahead, jump in, take a look at, just to see how that final round went. Here we go, the highlights from Ski. We saw, oh, as soon as he picked up that Kraber, he was finding shots everywhere. And it felt like even though Asu was our pro player, Ski was finding just as many shots. Here we go, we see Ace picking up a kill there, another one there, and it was just kill after kill for Asu and this duo. So, Ethos, I'm gonna come to you first. Let's start the scoring on Ski. He's currently in the lead right now, and he did have a pretty cool performance in that final round. So what do you think? I'll, I, I'm going to be brutally honest. I don't think it really matters what I think. I turned most of my cards into paper airplanes, and I'm out of many options. Um, so yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll give him what I have left. Okay. That's great. I'm glad that you're being resourceful. You know, like we said at the beginning of the show, we've really upgraded uh, what we have at the judge's desk. So feel free to, you know, maybe do some coloring for your paper plane as well. Yeah, it'd be great. You did great, though. Perfect. Now, EE, -E, so, how do we think he did? Um, who are we talking about? We're talking about Ski. Oh, Ski. He's currently in the lead Ski right did, now. Ski, Five points, man. Ski, you were on the Ski, couch. Listen, Ski did fine because, and let me tell you why. Because the fact that this brother was already sitting with a five-point lead, all he had to do was show up. He showed up. How can you not win? I'm not giving spoilers. I'm just saying. You can read between the lines. All right. And that's what EE's got for us. But Grady, I know that you're the one. You've been watching chat. And I've seen chat kind of take two sides. They're really pumped to see Ace. They're really pumped to see Ski. What do you think? The slump goddess says that Ski left no crumbs. You know, I'm, I'm seeing that Stokely took the dub. <laughs> But uh, I, I think it, well, I, I won't give him a score away yet. We'll give it next. All right. Well, I mean, you're the final judge that we're speaking to about Ski. So, judges, if you could, please reveal your scores for Ski. For the final round, we have one, two, three, uh, eight, eight, and a nine. Impressive scores, just shy of 10. These are really strong scores for Ski, who, remember, he does have that five-point lead. So that being said, let's go ahead and start talking about his opponent, our Apex Pro player for today, which was, of course, Asu. So, Ethos, coming to you first. Asu, how do we feel about his final round performance? I mean, I think we all know how I feel about Asu. <laughs> Pretty strongly. Pretty strongly, right? Now, this is a PG stream. I don't want to get too into it, right? But, again, I made most of my cards into paper airplanes, so I have many options. So I'll make do with what I have. Wonderful, and thank you for reminding us all why we now have challengers restraining orders between you and some of our competitors. But EE, -E, you up next, Ace. What, up? what about his performance? Uh, big Ace fan. I think uh, he's an incredible player, incredible talent. I think he definitely showed up. The nerfs, definitely something that held him back from getting his optimal placement and optimal scores. We all mm -hmm. understand that. But you see what happens when you took the limiters off, right? He was able to kind of go that Rock Lee mode, you know what I'm saying? And he just went ham. Now, the thing about Rock Lee is he went ham, but he didn't win. Dun dun. Ooh. That's such a good reference. I love that you drop the training weights and you get the, uh, what was it? It was the 20th anniversary of Naruto the other day. So I, I get that topical reference. Grady, for you. Uh, I don't watch anime, but oh. I do play Apex, and I have never turned on someone with an R99 and unloaded a whole clip into someone's head before. I don't know how Ace does it. I don't know if he has a different controller than I do. I can't believe I just said controller. Uh, that's embarrassing. Uh, but, uh, but I mean, his, it's incredible to watch this kid play. Um, yeah, got to give credit where credit's due. Credit where credit's due. Did you just read that off of the I Twitch chat? I did read that off of the chat. You, you stole call it out. from the Twitch chat. The call out was you so unnecessary. You don't even want to give. You don't have to do that. So you don't want to give credit to the person in the chat. I saw that side eye, but listen, that's okay. Chat is a part of today's show, and I think it's great that you are spreading their message. Now, that being said, let's go ahead and see the final round of scores for Ace. Three, two, one. We have a nine from Grady, a nine from EE, -E, and a 27 again from Ethos, which again, it's capped at 10. So a 
Nine, a nine, and a ten are final scores from our okay, judges for aces. Again. I can't do the math. I don't know what it's going to be. I, I don't know what the math is either, but luckily we have the final, final scorecard ready. So let's go ahead and take a look and see how everything shook up. Oh! oh! And with a win by two points, Ski Mask, our challenger for today, has taken the win over Ace. Gentlemen, players, please <laughs> come join me in the front. We've got to talk about this victory. And it's funny because at the beginning of the day, you didn't think it was going to happen. You were also a little bit nervous. You it. saw this coming. <laughs> you did, huh? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, what was it I about him? I paid off the judges. No, you paid off the judges? <laughs> just playing, just Ace, what was it about him walking into the room that made you a little bit nervous? Because clearly it shook you up enough to the point where uh, you dropped before. two points. I, mean, I, I know what this guy can do in this server, and I, I saw it coming. <laughs> yeah, we played before. He's got the Millennium Puzzle on him. What am I supposed to do against that? <laughs> Man, it sent you straight to the Shadow yeah, Realm. That's actually, what he's going to do with that. But hey, <laughs> tell me about this win right now because it was close. But that being said, you're our challenger. You just, took down a pro today. I just want to thank my mom, my dad at home. Thank you all to my friends and family. <laughs> nah, um, I had fun. Um, Could have did way better. Of course, Ace was way better than me. <laughs> um, other than that, I had fun. So, yeah. Well, I'm glad that you have fun. And hopefully, I know we're in downtown LA right now and it's a little warm, but it is going to get pretty chilly soon. And that's why we have the challenger's jacket for Whoa. you. Our winner, our challenger for today. <laughs> I think that looks good with the Millennium Puzzle that you've got. Uh, I think something. it matches. Hey. Oh, that's okay. I'm that looks this. good. I'm this. <laughs> now, Asu, for you, I yeah. just want to say, I, he looks good in that jacket right now. You a little envious? I'm, I'm, yeah, a little bit. Yeah, I can <laughs> use that jacket. Well, don't worry, because you're going home with, with something. It's a very special prize. It's not the jacket, unfortunately. Jake, what do we have for Asu? A better jacket? We have an O. I'm oh, sorry. Okay. <laughs> I'll, 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 I'll gladly take that L. All right, fair enough. Yeah, Asu, forever. yeah, definitely going home with the L, but that's okay. Above you can frame it, put it right above your bed so uh -huh. that every single morning you wake up and just have, you know, some sort of a uh, memento of what occurred here today. I'm going to give this to my kids. If I, if I, have kids, <laughs> I want to pass it down for centuries. Generations to generations. But again, you lost here, but that's okay because you said that you're going to TwitchCon, I believe, this oh, week yeah, to Twitch participate Con. in Twitch Rivals, right? Oh, uh, yep. I'll be there. So there you go. There's your chance for redemption and Speaking of, of which, course. TwitchCon, I believe, Jake, you're going to be there too. What are you doing at TwitchCon? Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll be there hosting a booth for the great production behind here in Crown Channel. So uh, anyone out there, we got giveaways and some nice stuff. Okay. No L's, so a lot of W's, though. <laughs> I'll be there. Cool. Yeah. Will people be able to, like, meet you, shake your hand, touch your hair? Yeah, meet me, uh, face. yeah, touch your whatever, face. whatever you want. Cut the hair, maybe, give some hugs out. But again, <laughs> a, lot of, a lot of giveaways. The Crown Channel booth over at TwitchCon should be a fun freaking time. A lot of seltzers? Absolutely. Might Selfies <laughs> abound. Uh, that being said, Asu, mm -hmm. any final last words that you'd like to give for all of your fans who showed up here to support you today? Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys had as much fun watching as we had playing. And um, yeah, hopefully I don't disappoint like this at TwitchCon. <laughs> <laughs> And Ski, for you, we saw a ton of Ski emotes in the chat. We had a ton of people asking hey. for more music, people saying, hey, it's October, let's see something special. Very Anything sweet. that you'd like to say to all of your fans in the chat? Um, thank you for coming and watching. Look out for new music this month for sure. And yeah, let's get it. Let's get it. How about that? Thank you very much, Ski. And again, congratulations. Thank and you. for everyone, that is it for us here today. So on behalf of me, Jake, all of our hosts, we have Ethos, we have EE, we have Grady, and of course, Asu and Ski, and everyone here in production for Crown. Thank you all so, so much for watching, and we will see you all next time. Woo!